as soon as I started playing, this was even during the tutorial, there was nobody even in there. And I'm like, when do I have to give this back? We get to keep this, right? That was my immediate first thing. In any role playing game, there's, of course, there's, there's spiders and rats. There has to be spiders and rats. That's just going to be a given. But they're not ever in 3D, like on your character. That was particularly disgusting. The different effects that are in the game, it gives it that feeling that you had when you were a kid and you're like, oh, wow. And that, that stuff is really hard to make in games. It's really hard to get that reaction. I, I mean, I've been making games for a million years at this point in time and playing them for two million. It's really hard to get that reaction, and that was a genuine reaction. I was not expecting that at all. It was beautiful. When the swords came raining down out of the sky, I don't even know how I would have reacted to that as a kid, but I feel like I reacted the same way today because it was just so unexpected. I mean, it just creates an immediately playful space that you already know how to play. Absolutely loved it. This is what you wanted in the 80s. This is what you wanted and was not possible. Oh, no. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Yes! Critical hit! Oh, man. Oh, no! Oh, love it, love it, love it!